Um, next is Chaba. Chaba. I can't remember how to pronounce your name. Yeah. Chaba and Meti um, on scrollable widget containers. Yes, and scroll area widget. That is the first subject. Okay. So you can see, I will actually talk about two different themes, but they are somehow related. The one is uh, sc the scroll area widget, that is a new mega widget I wrote, uh, and the second uh, subject is scrollable widget containers. Actually, using the mouse um, scroll wheel in scrollable widget containers. Okay, so you can see in the abstract uh, the same uh, two themes, the scroll area mega widget and, and after that how to, how to use the mouse wheel in scrollable widget containers like the B widget scrollable frame that is a known um, widget within the B widget uh, library. Uh, and uh, there is another one, I widget scrolled frame. There are still other implementations of things which I simply call widget containers. Actually, they are scroll, called scrollable frame, scrolled frame, uh, or, or some variations of these two names, but actually they are all based, most, most uh, of them are based on, on, on a frame and, and a canvas, and so actually the technique uh, behind that uh, is, is not, uh, not uh, something uh, spectacular, but the result is, is, is quite useful. Okay. So let's see the scroller uh, util scroll area widget. Uh, this is a new mega widget, which uh, can really greatly simplify the creation of scrolled widgets. There are all kinds of scrolled widgets, and, and the way to create them is always the same. Set, uh, set the options, uh, create the scroll bars, uh, uh, and after that manage all these things together. So that is always, always the same, and, and it, it, it can get uh, quite, uh, uh, quite tedious and, and sometimes uh, much, much too technical. So uh, that was why I, I saw the need to, to write a, a mega widget that, that can, can really greatly simplify all these tasks. Uh, there are some already some, some widgets uh, that are similar. Uh, maybe the most known ones are this uh, scrolled window for, uh, of, of B widget. Then, then there is a, a SNIT-based equivalent uh, uh, written by, by Jeff Hobbs, and it is also, uh, for example, in the active state, uh, active state uh, distribution, it is, it is actually a uh, part of, of TKLib or so. Then there is one, I don't know whether, they, whether you know that one, the Scrojet is also SNIT based, is written by Aldo Burati. And this guy here, Johann Oberdorfer, uh, just wanted to see how to, how to port a SNIT based application to OO and, and he has he has written a, a OO based equivalent of, of the Scrojet uh, uh, written by Aldo Burati. Actually, what, what Johan did, uh, he took that, that uh, uh, an earlier Scrojet version and, and ported it to, to OO. Uh, in the meantime, the Scrojet itself was still developed uh, further, but uh, Johan's version is. Uh, uh, corresponds to that earlier earlier one of uh, it. Okay. Uh, what is what makes this this widget different from from all these uh, and some some others? I I wanted I wanted a full table list support of course of course I wanted a full table list support and I, I will I will uh, uh, show in a minute 
what I mean with, with, with uh, full table is uh, support. Uh, um, then, of course, uh, it, it should also be good for, for widgets that are only scrollable in one direction. For example, um, entry widgets. Um, then uh, there is a known shimmering problem actually uh, and originally um, demonstrated in connection with, with the auto uh, scroll package by, by uh, Kevin Kenny. And, uh, but actually this shimmering problem is present in the case of all, all um, widgets uh, of this kind that do automatic uh, scroll bar management. Uh, and I, I also wanted to, to have a, a mega widget that is, that is free from this, uh, this problem. Okay. And I, I also wanted no dependencies, no B widget dependency, no SNIT dependency, no, no, and not even uh, tickle or, or dependency because, because what I did what I, what I created here that, that, is, uh, that is usable for any Tico version, starting with 8.0. Uh, so, so, and there was, of course, no SNIT at that time, and uh, uh, no OO, and, and nothing. Okay. Uh, the API is quite, uh, quite uh, simple. Uh, the widget has the usual standard options. Those um, grayed out are not available for the tile-based version, like hi highlight, uh, highlight, color, highlight, uh, thickness, uh, uh, and background. Uh, yeah. All the others are, are available for both for, for the classical and, and, and the tile-based uh, case. Uh, there are only four uh, for widget specific options. The, the first two are table list specific, because uh, and you, uh, I, I will uh, show you in a minute uh, what they what they actually uh, mean. Uh, and the the X scroll bar mode and Y scroll bar mode, they have the usual. Uh, obvious meaning. You can have static scroll bars, you can have dynamic scroll bars that only appear on demand, on other when necessary, when needed, or, the, or, or you can just suppress the, the uh, scroll bars. Uh, and there are only two, uh, only two uh, usual common commands and two other ones. Uh, so actually, uh, quite quite uh, easy, quite uh, simple um, uh, API for this. Okay, let's see a few examples. Uh, I will start with an example for, for for table list. Here, the first code is a classical one. So that is the way you usually create a scrollable widget and the scroll bars and set the the options for the widget and, and, and usually one can use pack or, or even better um, uh, grid to manage all this together. Um, I can, um, yes, live presentation. So yes, I, uh, no, I, can, I can show you in a minute uh, how it works. Maybe we should start this uh, with this. Uh, demonstration that is the first script here scroll table list number one there is nothing special but but uh, uh, still some something that is uh, that is uh, uh, maybe maybe table is specific but not only table is specific can you see these two scroll bars how where they start uh, the vertical one starts just below the header portion, below the, below the not only not only the header labels, but also if you have header items that are not scrollable they, uh, themselves, then 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 it 
is actually quite logical and also common uh, on the Mac and also on, 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 uh, in, in environments based on GTK, uh, especially that the scroll bar just uh, appears just below that header. And the same is valid for the, for the title columns. If you have title columns, that is columns that, that are not scrollable themselves, then it, it, is, it is better to have a, a, a horizontal scroll bar which is just to, uh, to the right of that, of that non-scrollable non uh, uh, title column area. Okay, to have, to have this, uh, uh, this result, the code is uh, rather complicated, uh, let's say rather technical. It is re really, really not, not, not uh, um, quite interesting to to have to have uh, these uh, these uh, code parts in, in all your applications. It is much more, much, much, e much more, much easier to have this one, this this uh, version. Just create a scroll area widget. Create your ta your table list as a child of that, uh, of that uh, uh, scroll, uh, scroll, uh, scroll area widget and, and just invoke the set widget uh, command. That is all. Everything else is managed automatically, including all these options. For example, that option uh, um, respect headers on the respect title columns. Um, on the Mac, the, the default is yes, respect them. Uh, on Windows, uh, not quite so. Only only for the horizontal scroll bar and so on. So all these all these um, uh, uh, platform specific uh, specific uh, differences are 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 are, uh, are uh, handled within the scroll area widget. Okay. Um, so that is what I meant with full table list support. I don't know of any other uh, similar widget uh, offering, um, providing all these, all these uh, features uh, for full table list support. Okay. So that is that was one of the main reasons why I, I just wanted to 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 write such a widget. Then, if you still recall, I, I also said I wanted uh, support for widgets that are only uh, that are scrollable in in one direction only. And now I I could show you again all all kind uh, and all all these all these uh, 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 scripts, but, uh, but let's see, let's, let's, uh, let's uh, try for example this one, this is, this is scrolled window that is, uh, that is as far as I can recall, that is that, uh, that's cr that uh, SNIT based um, version written by Jeff Hobbs. Uh, if I, if I, uh, uh, first I have to, first I have to kill this process and after that I can start, I, ah, sorry, sorry, sorry. Something, something is wrong. Okay. Um, ah. and we test and let's see and we test and let's take this one uh, I think this is exactly this one if we Okay, that is that is the only other widget, uh, similar widget that supports supports this case. So you can see if if you have a, an entry, and 
and you have the need to so uh, and there arises the need to 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 uh, for the scroll bar to appear then it it appears it's no problem but uh, but uh, if we try the same thing with uh, let's say with this b widget uh, or, or scrojet or whatever then we will get ah scrojet Something is wrong with with my environment. Uh, I just know, don't know why Scrooget. Uh, sorry, ask. Uh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Scrooget. Okay. Yes, you see. So it is not supported. So it is not supported to have to have uh, to have um, an entry in such a such a B widget. Uh, what's the name? So uh, that in that uh, mega widget. Okay. But of course, of course, if now the same thing entry test and the test and now if we start scroll util this so this new widget scroll util ah. then it it works just just uh, as as expected Okay, so this is this was this was the second the second need I I I spoke about, and I also wanted uh, to have uh, to have a, a mega widget where this shimmering problem is is not uh, not present. Um, I can, for example, I pro probably it, it won't work. Uh, let's see. There is something wrong with my my uh, shimmering test. We have here shimmering test. Ah, uh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Shimmering, and now if we have shimmering test and scrolled and this auto scroll. So that that is a classical shimmering problem. Is auto scroll, uh, auto scroll. Let's see how it works. Can you see? Can you see the shimmer, the shimmering? It is shimmering and shimmering and shimmering. So, so this is no good. This is this is really a problem. It it should not not be the case. So this is a, a known deficiency of, of this auto scroll uh, package. And now I could show you that all the others, really all the others have the same problem. All, all these uh, um, similar widgets. But of course this new one is free from from, 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 this, from that, uh, let's see, let's see, shimmering and let's see, let's see the new one. Scroll, widget scroll, Nikwatch. Scroll, scroll. Uh, where is it? Scroll util. Scroll util. Exactly. So, okay. So there is a. There is a portion where the, the horizontal scroll bar uh, gets displayed, but after that it, it, it disappears again. So it doesn't shimmer. So that, is, that was quite, quite important. So it is not as bad if, if there, is a, there is a quite small portion uh, area of, of, of the whole widget where, where the scroll bar uh, appears. It is, in my opinion, much much worse if if it is if it starts shimmering and and doesn't doesn't stop shimmering. So, okay. Ah. 
So this is why I created this, this mega widget. It, it seems to, to, to behave as, as expected in all the circumstance, so circumstances. Now let's, let's talk something about uh, mouse wheel. Uh, in my um, humble opinion, the mouse wheel is one of the, of the uh, most brilliant inventions of the computer industry, yeah. really. So it is, it, but it is quite interesting to, to see a short uh, history of, of this thing. The first one at all was, was developed and, 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 uh, and uh, presented and uh, yeah, um, in, uh, invented and de developed uh, by, by two companies. One, this is uh, this uh, Japanese telegraph and telephone company and this Agenes uh, Wischer uh, Technische uh, Hochschule, Zurich, Switzerland. But it, and two years later, another, uh, it, was, uh, it, it, it had the scroll wheel on the side. Uh, two years later, another one, another mouse was presented having a scroll uh, wheel on top. And it took many years until 1995. Uh, the first commercial mouse was was uh, uh, released. Uh, you see, me, uh, I can still remember the genius mouse. Maybe some of you too. Yeah, that was the famous uh, genius mouse having having uh, 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 having a scroll bar, uh, having a scroll uh, uh, scroll wheel. Sorry, a scroll wheel, and. Just an example uh, concerning Microsoft. Microsoft did really a good, uh, <laughs> it was a, a, a positive step that uh, Microsoft released the IntelliMouse. Maybe you can still uh, uh, recall that uh, uh, the IntelliMouse. So Microsoft uh, re uh, uh, released the, the IntelliMouse and at the same time they introduced support for mouse wheel in Microsoft Office. That was a, a really, really um, uh, important step uh, towards popularization of, of the mouse wheel. And nowadays, I think there is nowhere in the world uh, a, a new mouse you, you, could, you could buy without uh, having a scroll, scroll uh, uh, wheel. Good. Uh, now let's see the support for scroll wheel in TK. Uh, okay, you can see this, this history here. What, is, what was very interesting, uh, the problem actually was, uh, you can see uh, support for mouse wheel was introduced in TK, um, uh, first uh, for Lisbox and text uh, widgets, and after that uh, under, uh, under Unix, uh, Linux, they also uh, introduced uh, these support for these two events, button four and five, that actually emulate uh, the mouse wheel. Yeah. Um, there, is, there was a famous tip written 2004 um, concerning the handling of the mouse wheel. The problem was, uh, was under uh, uh, on Linux, the mouse wheel really scrolls what is under the mouse. On Windows, it was different. On Windows, uh, th that widget was scrolled that had the focus. A great uh, difference between the two platforms. And this tip proposed to change the mouse wheel event bindings in order, order to have uh, uh, the same behavior on, on, on both uh, platforms. It is a quite good thing that this tip was not actually, was not implemented in that way. Instead of this tip, they, uh, the, uh, the TK uh, developers just, just uh, changed the C code of, of the Windows part, of the Windows platform, uh, in such a way that uh, on, on Windows, uh, uh, the widget uh, under the 
uh, uh, mouse is scrolled just like just like under under Unix, just just like on on, on Unix. And it took uh, it took one more year after uh, after that until at last uh, uh, that uh, that new mouse handling got its way into into 8.6. Okay. Uh, now actually, and, and unfortunately, I I have uh, little time left, but it is uh, still important, and I will try, uh, try to to to. Uh, Make it short. Uh, what's the problem now? You, you, we, ha we have a mouse with with mouse wheel, with with, with mouse uh, with scroll wheel, and and we have a scrollable widget container. But the scrollable widget containers have no no bindings for 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 the mouse wheel. So we have some. So we need actually some code uh, to get uh, to to write uh, to create mouse wheel uh, bindings. Yes, and that is uh, why I, I wrote a few uh, a few commands for for this. Uh, so create wheel event bindings, and 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 enable scroll scrolling by wheel. So these are the first uh, two steps uh, you need. Uh, after that, you can uh, you can uh, you have to uh, to to. Invoke this adapt wheel event handling for those widget, widgets that are scrollable themselves. Without this step, we, you will have um, you, you will have the funny situation that the scroll wheel will will scroll the widget under the mouse and the scrollable widget container. So quite quite dangerous can can it can it become? So it is not good. Okay. Uh, let's uh, let's uh, uh, forget about the last uh, uh, last uh, command. It is uh, it is also important, but not as important as the others. So these are actually the the new commands I, I wrote, and uh, I just want to show you two examples, and 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 let's let's stop after that. Um, the first example is um, mm, the first demo. demo. Ah, I, 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 I don't know what's the problem. Scroll, 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 level, scrollable, sorry. Scrollable. Sc yeah, okay, okay. S I know, of course, that I have to write the C, but <laughs> okay. Uh, let's let's take the first one, the first uh, example. Just a small uh, toy. Um, what what is the problem here? We have uh, we have um, um, TTK combo boxes. If you have a TTK combo box, the combo box itself has has mouse wheel event bindings, as you can see. And uh, now let's let's say um, um, the okay. Actually, uh, yes. Uh, due to the new uh, functions uh, shown here. Uh, uh, the widget container will not uh, be scrolled. Scrolled only the widget having the having the the focus is 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 scrolled. Now let's uh, let's resolve this. So if if the mouse is not over a widget having uh, over the widget having the scroll having the the focus the focus. Uh, the scrolling will will uh, will work for the widget container and not for not for the for that widget. So that is quite important. Uh, and the last one, and and that is the the really the end. Sorry, sorry for the. But we had we we had a. Um, um, Sorry. Okay. 
And, and now this is another, another example, which, which is also interesting because, as you can see, now, now, I, now, I, now I can rotate the mouse, uh, the scroll wheel, and the, the, the scrollable widget container will not, not be scrolled, just because we have, we have uh, just because this, this combo box has, has uh, its, uh, its uh, shell uh, popped down. It is, it is quite important, it is a small detail, an important detail actually, but, but detail not, not, for the, not for the programmer, but it is a detail important within, within the implementation. And uh, the rest is, is just a demonstration. Uh, if, if I have the focus, for example, on the list box, then the list box was, will, be, will be scrolled if, 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 if I am Outside that list box, then, then the, the widget container and so on. So that is that is uh, uh, important to to have uh, to distinguish between the widget having the focus and and other 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 places within that scrollable frame. So that that was. Okay. Thanks, Chaba. Mm -hmm.